It was in the Himalayas when I met Tootie Lou. Tootie Lou was a solid, and inside him there were little molecules, so tiny that not even a human could see them. Um, in between the molecules, um, the space in between it, it's called intermolecular space. Um, but the space in a solid in between those molecules are very, very small. The only movement that those molecules can do is vibrate. Tootie is at the solid phase. Tootie has a definite shape and a definite volume. You can see Tootie lives inside an igloo like in the Himalayas. A couple years later, Tootie left for New Delhi. One day, when he was out, um, he didn't notice that it was that hot, and he noticed that there was a lot of puddles, like a really big puddle forming around him. And this was when he was melting. This um, is Tootie when he melted. Um, so just like in a solid, a liquid has molecules. But in a liquid, since there's a little bit more energy, the liquid, the so the molecules are spread more apart. So the intermolecular, that's the space in between a uh, eat all the molecules. The intermolecular space is a little bit bigger. So this is the liquid phase. The temperature at which a solid changes into a liquid is called its melting point. Liquids have a definite volume but not a definite shape. So while Toby was melting, a cat named Linda saw him. So, it, so she knew what was going to happen next. So she got a cup and she scooped him up and placed him on the grass. Of course, that was still not too smart of her because steam started coming out of the of the glass and she heard Toby screaming under the water Toby was flying around in the air um inside a gas there are molecules just like there are in a liquid and a solid um, but now the molecules are even more spread apart because there's so much more energy. And the intermolecular space is a lot, much, much more. Um, a gas has an indefinite volume and an indefinite shape. So Toby got kind of tired of just flying around in the air. So he decided to turn back into... A liquid. So Toby went back to his place in the Himalayas and when he got there after about an hour he started to turn into water just like he did when he melted. So there's Toby. Um, the water has the has and is the same thing as a liquid since like so he turned back so but um when a gas turns into liquid it's called condensation um an example is uh let's say you take a glass and you take water out of the fridge and then you put water in the glass it takes a little while but then water starts forming on the outside it's because something cold hit something not so cold, it was warm or room temperature, 
and that made it turn back into water. Another is when you're taking a really hot shower and the steam that's uh, coming out of the hot water hits like the mirror. The mirror is pretty cold for some reason and it turns into water again. So that's condensation. A little cat named Linda saw him and scooped him up and took him inside the house and put him in the freezer. About two hours later, she checked on him and there he was back. Toby was back and decided never to go anywhere if he didn't know that it was cold because he didn't want to go through that whole cycle again, even though it was kind of an adventure for him. So this is the life of an ice cube. Thanks for watching.